Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of Everything Kratom, the podcast about anything and everything. Kratom. Great to have you with us on this Friday morning. The end of the New York City week-long business trip is here. It's finally arrived. I'm getting ready to go home today. What is my Kratom strategy? Well, today, I'm going to start off by doing nothing. Because I think it's important that, uh, you know, that I don't take it if I don't need it. Right now, I'm good. You know, I have my energy. Breakfast, um, I had a little bit of coffee, which is abnormal for me, but I had a little bit. And usually, for me, coffee kind of takes away the positive benefits of Kratom. So I'm actually going to wait. Um, the, I still have a good boost from the coffee and it's going to uh, help me start off this trip. So I'm going to use that to my advantage. I'm going to take my break. I'm going to wait. And then mid trip, a few hours in, because it's about this five and a half, six hour drive that I have ahead of me, about halfway through, I'm going to find a rest stop, you know, go to the bathroom, take it, you know, get a bite to eat or something if I need to. And then I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for um, a combination, which I'm not sure I've ever had before, um, but we'll see. Because I, I don't like driving late at night, and I really need to be hyper aware when I'm coming back. I mean, it, you know, it's hunting season up here in the Northeast, so there's deer running around everywhere, um, especially late at night. And I do not, not, not want to hit a deer. Um, I love animals. I would not be happy doing that. So. Um, I am going to be hyper vigilant, hyper aware, super focused, uh, and finish out the week strong. I'm going to try this combination of white tie and Indo white. I haven't had Indo white all week. Uh, that's my heavy hitter and I love it. Um, white tie also a good heavy hitter, uh, good to rely on. I don't know if I've ever done the two together. I'm not sure. Maybe one of you can remind me if, if I've mentioned in a previous episode, but I don't think so. I don't remember and I don't I haven't written that one down before so I'm excited um I think that what's going to happen is uh it's going to be a huge boost of energy it's going to last a while um I think what I'll be doing is probably a gram and a half of each um so it should be a significant boost of energy it should keep me right on track you know the other thing I could do is I could stagger it I could take one and then wait a half an hour and take another but the issue is, is that I can't really do that while driving. And I don't have any capsules with me anymore. Like those were for the, the, you know, middle of the week, but I don't have any of those. So I'm going to have to like stop, get out of the car when I do it. Cause you can't really take Kratom as a toss and wash when you're driving. <laughs> any of you have tried that before, you know what I'm talking about. It's, uh, it's pretty difficult and probably not safe. So I'm going to get out of the car where, you know, pull off at a rest stop whenever I can and do this. Um, but I think that it's going to be really helpful. Uh, overall, the week went really well. Um, Kratom is just an incredible tool, you guys. It helped me so, so much. I don't know how I would have done this week otherwise. I mean, I would have gotten through it for sure, but it, I don't think I would have been as an effective worker as I was. I don't think that, um, you know, in addition to not doing my best, I don't think that I, I would have enjoyed my work as much. But, you know, I do enjoy my work, and I think that important that one does if they can not everyone's fortunate enough to so if you are fortunate enough to you definitely should right so um i think that it helps enhance the work experience it helped me enjoy walking around new york city more and listening to music while i'm walking uh it kept me on point throughout the week it helped me maintain my stable ground it helped me feel like i was still in my element even though i wasn't and uh overall it's just it's a great great thing that that i I definitely can confidently say that I rely on in a healthy way. Um, if I did not have it this week, all would have been fine and well. I would have gotten through the week and, you know, it wouldn't have been like a horrific train wreck of a week and or anything like that. But it just has helped me so much. And while I see my, my colleagues drinking, you know, five cups of coffee throughout the day, you know, I had a cup of black tea on Thursday. <laughs> Like, you know, it's pretty cool. I, I, a lot of times people will mention, like, you never drink coffee or anything. I'm like, no, no, I don't. <laughs> I don't really need it. And uh, and I don't get fidgety or anything from what 
but I, I used it to boost my my spirits and my energy. Um, so yeah, it's great. Although I did have my coffee this morning, but that's because I went to a little diner and it's like, how are you supposed to go to a diner and not have coffee, right? Come on. Anyway, so thanks for sticking with me through this whole week, you guys. Um, you know, I know these were very, very short tidbits this week, but it's kind of the nature of business travel. You don't really have much time to do this. So um, I appreciate your uh, going along with me. And um, we'll be back here on Monday morning with another great and episode and, and you know, home centered episode of everything creative. <laughs> so thanks so much, you guys. You, you all are great. And uh, I'll speak to you then. Have a great weekend. Bye bye.